<coughs> クリスタアー Hey hi mga guapo o guapa It's finally my day off and I am going out for window shopping or maybe buy something and this is gonna be my first window shopping ever after 7 months in quarantine So yes, let me take you with me today and actually the weather is 26 to 27 degrees so it's so beautiful super sunny however i'm wearing masks so it's a little bit hard to breathe and uh, it's a bit hot and here's the tram that i'm going to take You see right here, they are setting up an outdoor bar for the main event tomorrow. November 3 is Melbourne Cup, so it's a big celebration and you see everyone is setting up for the big event tomorrow. Okay, so as you can see, a lot of shops have already opened and it is lively to see everyone outside of course they're wearing masks and practicing social distancing so i don't think that's a problem and yes whew, way to go On this side of the Yarra River, you can see a lot of different cuisines, restaurants and pubs and I'm actually going to a factory outlet mall where you can find a lot of stuff in cheaper prices. So yes, it's called DFO. So this is the Platypus outlet store and uh, to tell you, maybe it's not so obvious but I really love shoes. So here you can find a lot of discounted items that are really 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 good deal. More on my side. I was thinking get this two color. So here's the second wall right into the CBD center. 
with a lot of Christmas decorations, but I don't really feel like Christmas. go up. Hey, hi, I'm Gopu Gopa. So yes, I am finally back home and whew, it was so much fun, but I'm still not used to being around a lot of people. I still feel a little bit scared. So yes, I tried to avoid going to super crowded places except for one special shop. I didn't have a choice. I waited there for about 30 minutes because there was a long queue and yes i need to get some items so i had to do it and i'm gonna show you what i've got from today's shopping i went to a couple of clothes shops and i didn't find anything interesting or good really so there are a lot of sales like the items are 50 percent off 40 percent off but i i don't think they are worth paying for because Mm, just based on my observations, I think those were like old stocks from last year or a few years back. So yeah, I didn't really think spending my money on those kind of things that I don't really need and I can't imagine if I'm going to use them. So yes, I didn't buy any clothes today, although I bought some very important skincare products. So I have run out of um, skincare and um, especially makeup remover so I got them today because I need it and yeah I went to the store called it's in Japanese <laughs> so I don't know but it says Muji <laughs> does it say like Muji does it say Muji Kuma Kore Muji Muji Okin Muji Okin what, the, what, what is yoki? Good item. Good item. Muji yoki. Muji good item. Muji good item. So yes, I went to this store. It's called Muji yoki. Muji good item. So it's a Muji shop here in Melbourne. Um, it's actually um, a Japanese store. And you can buy clothes. So apparel, furniture, uh, down to scrapbooking materials all made in Japan and I think that's the reason why it was packed a lot of people adore Japanese items I'm going to show you what's inside this paper bag first item I'm going to show is this one so it's a moisturizing milk lotion it's for the face and so far i've already finished one bottle of this and it is really helping me a lot when it comes to my dry skin and it's not this is light so it says light right over here there you go it says light so it doesn't make my skin super oily just perfect and another one that i've got is its partner so this is a toning water light toning water high moisture so these two are my favorite so normally i use the toner first on my face and then moisturizer milk and last one in the bag Ta -da! <laughs> i've got a milk cleanser so i have not tried 
any type of milk cleanser. So this is going to be my first one to try and I'm going to make a separate video I guess. If you guys want to see that just comment down below if you want to see me try all these um, skincare products from Muji Japan. Yeah, just comment down below if you want a content like that. I actually was using a cleansing oil and it was my first try and then I finished the whole bottle and cleansing oil works perfectly when it comes to removing makeup and also removing my dark what do you call that one dark spots on the nose yes ugly dark spots it works really well I love Muji skincare products and the prices are very very affordable and I think it's reasonable let me just check if I have the receipt. Ting! Yes, I've got it right here. So let's see. Um, so the toning water is $12.11.95 and the moisturizing milk is $15.95. So that's about $16. This one right here. And the cheapest one that I've got today is no they're about they're actually the same price I thought this one's cheaper and okay so anyway I was checking the receipt and this one they gave us the wrong price they gave us $16 for this but it's supposed to be $10 so not a good thing all right, so I'm gonna go back to the store maybe tomorrow or the other day. I'm not gonna use this product yet. I need a refund. Hey, we're done. So that's it for today. Um, yes, I hope you enjoyed a quick tour around Melbourne city and first window shopping ever. So for so basing on the video, you see a lot of people, but they're not really buying stuff. They're just walking around, basically window shopping, just like me. I hope you like this video. If you do, please don't forget to put a thumbs up. And guys, come on, click that subscribe button, please. Please subscribe. Click, 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 click. Thank you so much. I'll see you on the next one. Bye. Anyway, before I say goodbye, I just want to share my makeup for today's look. There you go. I just want to show off my makeup and also my accessories. I want to say thank you to myself <laughs> for all these. Anyway, bye guys. Bye, 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 bye.